it's like all of a sudden we were this couple, okay? And this alarm started going off in my head, you know? Run for your life, get out of the building! <laughs> Men are unbelievable. What is it with you people? I mean, the minute you start to feel something, you have to run away? I know, that... <laughs> That's why I don't want to go tonight. I'm afraid I'm gonna say something stupid. Oh, you mean like that guy thing where you act all mean and distant until you get us to break up with you. Mm -hmm. Hey, you know about that? <laughs> right, look, what do I do? I want to get past this. I don't want to be afraid of the commitment thing. I want to go through the tunnel to the other side. Where there's no fear of commitment. Are you okay? No, I am. I actually am. I mean, this is amazing. My entire life, I have feared this place. And now that I'm here, it's like, what was the big deal? I mean, I could probably say, let's move in together. And I'd be okay. You probably want us to move in together? <laughs> it doesn't scare me. Yeah, well, it scares me. I mean, I'm not even divorced yet. Chandler, you know, you just invited me over here for pasta, and all of a sudden you're, like, talking about moving in together, and I wasn't even that hungry. You know what? It's getting really late, and I, I should just, um... Oh, no, no, don't go. I've scared you. I've said too much. I'm hopeless and awkward and desperate for love. There you go, honey. This will help. So I finally catch up to her, and she says this relationship's going too fast, and we have to slow down. Ugh. That is never good. And then I got all needy and clingy. Oh. Okay. No, wait a minute, wait a minute. Maybe it's not so bad. How did you leave it? She said she'd call me. Oh. Oh, God. Oh. Welcome to our side of the tunnel. Oh. His ice cream tastes like crap, by the way. Yeah, well, that's that low cal, non dairy soy milk junk. We sort of, we save the real stuff for the truly terminal cases. You know, when you start getting screwed over all the time, you gotta switch to low fat. Yeah, you do. So you, you don't think I'm terminal? Oh, no, not at all. You're not terminal. You just, we just need some damage control. All right. Okay, okay. So should I call her? No! <laughs> it's a very critical time right now. If you feel yourself reaching for that phone, you go shoe shopping. You get your butt in a bubble bath. If you want her back, you have got to start acting aloof. She has to know that you're not needy. Right. So what you have to do is, you have to accidentally run into her on purpose and then act aloof. So I'm, I'm not gonna lose her? Oh, honey, you're not a total loser. I said, so I'm not gonna lose her? <laughs>